This here is the Yoshihiro VG10 46 layers hammered Damascus series. The Damascus layering is in the clad steel and it's very elegant but also reinforces the strength of the steel. The blade thickness does not exceed 2 millimeters, making it a very thin and sharp blade. The handle is made out of rosewood. It is D-shaped, making it very comfortable to use for our right-handed users. All knives in this series comes with a magnolia wood saya cover for easy storage. The series also comes with a magnolia wood handle and offers a variety of knives such as the Gyuto, Sujihiki, Santoku, Nakiri. This right here is a 240mm Sujihiki knife. The thin, sharp, and long profile of the knife allows the blade to go through ingredients in one long strokes, preserving the flavor and freshness. This here is our 210mm Gyuzo knife, an all-purpose knife with the versatility to handle a multitude of tasks. The Aimaku 8 inch chef knife is the essential kitchen knife designed for professionals who include chefs, culinary experts, food caterers, as well as an ordinary person. The chef's knife is an indispensable all purpose kitchen knife that can be used for chopping, mincing, slicing, and dicing. Due to the weight and the balance of the knife, it is wear resistant, durable, rust, and stain resistant. Ergonomic design offers a suitable cutting experience. Archer Sharp Edge makes your cutting more easily and smoothly. To make it more professional and minimize any fatigue, finger numbness or aches after holding it continuously for an extended time. The knife's handle is made from parka. This handle allows firm and more durable gray. It's known for its comfort, strength, and stability. Hello you guys and welcome back to another Vivian Tries. It is diamond infused ceramic coating. It will chop, dice, slice, mince, carve. All knives do that, right? Diamond infused ceramic coating is five times stronger than steel. I don't think there's anything fancy on the peeler besides <laughs> it's blue. Ooh, I like the color. You guys know I like that navy blue this is not navy blue this is like a cobalt is that a color cobalt blue get our peeler out which oh they're kind of cute i'm not gonna cry about it now they do claim to have a lifetime stay sharp guarantee <laughs> it just it's like a regular knife now it does feel nicer than this dollar tree one <laughs> so here are the two knives I think they're kind of okay one is a little smaller this one is an eight inch this is probably what a six inch knife this one feels like it's a one dollar knife this one it feels heavier than this one i like this uh faux gator handle look that we got going on there it does feel nice ready 
It did cut yeah. it, look, a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Let's, let's try from up high. Ready? One, two, three, go. I missed. <laughs> See, this is why I don't want to do it too high because my aim is pretty bad. Ready? One, two, three, go. <laughs> I'm, this is going to take about 30 takes. Ready? One, two, three, go. <laughs> Ready? One, two, three, go. Oh! Pretty good, look at it. Oh, okay. Wait, I mean, it didn't go all the way through. Oh, because he was like this. Okay, now for fun, let's just try peeling this potato. Ew, uh, absolutely not. No, it's not smooth when you're peeling. Let's try the can test. This better not ruin my knife. I'm gonna be very upset. So in the infomercial, they also use the can. He cut the can in half and then, okay, ready? Do it fast. I can't. You guys, they did this in the infomercial. They cut the can. I can't cut the can. Did I just ruin that? So, I'm gonna give the Diamond Sharp two Vivian heads. All right, you guys, so that is it for another Vivian Tries. I hope that you have enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!